Hey, how's it going everyone? So in today's video I'll be talking about what we could see coming to Legends this week. Now at the moment I can't actually go into the game to show this sort of stuff because we've got a ma like emergency maintenance. But yeah, I'd love to talk about what we can see this week because we are in a bit of a... Not quite pickle, but a bit of a situation, right? So everyone was expecting an Ultra release, right? So obviously with an Ultra release we'd expect uh, like a reveals and stuff announcement. But currently at this point, we have received none of that, right? We don't know anything that's going to happen if we're going to get reveals and stuff, or if it's going to be a surprise announcement, who knows, right? But we are still part of the Cell Saga you know, campaign, so that does obviously leave a few things up in the air. Now, my prediction was that we're probably going to get an Ultra uh, Super Saiyan 2 Gohan. But to me, if that's the case, I would have expected reveals and stuff announcement by now. I would say the absolute latest would be tomorrow after this video uploads, but I don't think we will get one because usually they do it at least two. I think two to three days. I think three days is usually the time, but two days, you know, max is when they'll do the announcement. So for no announcement yet is a bit weird. Now it could be because the servers are currently, I guess, crashing. That's why they do the emergency maintenance. That could be the reason why. There could be. You know, the hands might be full trying to sort that stuff out. But it might not be, right? It could also be... You know, one of the theories I have as well we could see is actually a Mega Rising banner. And if that's the case, I think that's why Legends is just like, yeah, we just... You know, who, who really cares about it? We'll just sort of push it aside. And they'll probably just do like, you know, maybe like, not a secret... Not a secret announcement. Uh, not a secret announcement, but just like, um... Just like a, you know, how they usually just post a video up, just saying, yeah, here's a new character, you know, he's a little bit of the details sort of thing. But if not, I don't really see what else they're going to do. Because last week we did get uh, this Gohan here, we did get his um, equipment. Which, um, yeah, gave us a little bit of stuff to do, but other than that, there wasn't really too much else to do. Um, we'll quickly check again, because this does show the latest events. Doesn't look like anything else, anything else has been said here. Yeah, maintenance notice. I think this is just literally, like I just said before, just emergency maintenance. Um, yeah it is. So nothing, nothing big there yet again. Uh, I'll just quickly check your yeah, news. Yeah, so this is what they're fixing, which... I guess I'll quickly cover it. Basically... Yeah, there's been a lot of connection issues with P like PvP for some reason. Uh, but yeah, so there's no other news at the moment. I think what we'll do is, because luckily, yeah, this uh, this website's a thing. We can actually have a look at the banners here, because this is how I roughly work out what's going to happen, right? Like what banners, you, you know, when to expect the next banner, right? So that be weekend banner. Don't worry about that. Don't have to worry about the master pack one, the ultra rising one, same thing. Mega Rising still got eight days left. And then, so this one's got eight days as well. well basically nine days, right? So nine days, 15. Oh, that's going on for a long time. So the Legend of Seven one does go, like the Goku one does go away in practically two days. So basically when we should expect the next banner. Other than that, there's no other big hints. I mean, what they could do... No... Uh, I guess it is very likely is since these banners up, so you got the Mega Rising one there and also the, the Vegeta one there, what they could do is this week gave like give us an LF Zenkai, so maybe perfect cell, he can get his Zenkai. And then the next week after is when we get the Ultra unit. That could be what they're doing. Potentially, because these being up for a bit longer than usual. I mean the Vegeta one I expected to be up longer. But the Mega Rising one here to be up for another 9 days is a bit weird. But if they hold the banner off till next week, you know, that leaves, uh, what, let's say roughly 3 days. Two, 2 or 3 days of the Mega Rising banner still being up and then the Ultra one at the same time. Because by then, you know, Goku Black's one will be gone. But this has to go away in 5 days. So they could also... They could also just like... Give us a day to download like before this Rose A banner goes away and then drop the next Ultra or LF, whatever we're going to get. They could do that. 
But I wouldn't say the likelihood's very high for that, because I still have a feeling if it's an Ultra, they're going to do reveals and stuff. Now, I guess you could bring up the topic that you didn't do for Kid B. I think it was Kid B. And they just sort of, same thing, they're just going, hey, here's a new unit, you know, here's a little bit of his kit, that's it, right? They could do that. So for me, if they're going to do that, it's not going to be a hype release. So if, if that's going to be the case, I think the Ultra's probably going to be like Super Trunks, I was going to say Cell, but I don't think Cell is still going to want to do reveals and stuff. Or it could be the Instant Transmission Goku as well for an Ultra. I don't know if that's really an Ultra worthy. I think more of an LF. But who knows, they could do Ultras for literally anything. So, I don't know, if, it could also just be a Mega Rising. But yeah, again, what are they going to do? Like Trunks? Trunks and Cell again? Probably not. So I don't know, there, there's still a lot to think about. I'm not too sure what road they're going to go down. I think an Ultra would be better. But a Mega Rising could be good as well, right? Because that's two units that could buff Cell Saga, for example, which obviously would be a little bit more beneficial. But yeah, again, it's hard to tell what Legends is going to do because, like I said, no reveals and stuff is a bit odd. Because even with Mega Rising banners, they usually do your reveals and stuff anyway, so... Unless they got nothing else... You know, maybe there's no other Zenkai, it, they just got the banner they're going to release this week, and that's why they're not doing anything. But looking at these banners here, I'm assuming what they're going to do is just give us a Zenkai this week, and they'll have Zenkai, probably like I said, for sale. I guess we have a quick look at that before we wrap up the video, so let's go characters real quick. Um, I already clicked that, so go okay. Legend Limited real quick. No, I clicked the wrong one. But yeah, I don't, I don't really know what else they could do, to be honest. Because if, if they're going to hold off to next week, we need something, you know, something to keep the players going. So, yeah, these are the only LFs, and obviously Gohan's got one, so you've only got the Perfect Form Cell there, or just Perfect Cell. So obviously Perfect Cell's going to get it first, because the Perfect Form Cell came out last year, I'm pretty sure. So if that's the case, obviously Perfect Cell will be the next one. And if that's the case, I would say there's like a 99.99% chance the Ultra will be Gohan. But, who knows, we'll have to wait and see, right? But yeah, that'll be it for today's video, guys. Um, if you have any other thoughts as well, who you think we might get for an, ult like an Ultra, LF, Mega Rising, anything like that, uh, please let me know in the comment section below what your guys' thoughts are. And uh, yeah, if you guys like this video and you want to see more, please like and subscribe. And see you as I win the next one.